puppies. <sighs> wow, <clears throat> every day is different here. Um, I'll take the opportunity to answer some questions because I keep getting the same questions over and over. And if I answer questions, maybe I can distract myself from the cold a little bit. So I don't live in this place where I'm dipping. Um, I live on the other side of Canada in a place called Nova Scotia, on the east coast of Canada, on the Atlantic Ocean. So when I'm at home, I dip normally in lakes because my city has like 40 lakes. So I'm really very lucky. Or I dip in the Atlantic Ocean. I'm not a huge fan of dipping in the ocean um, in the winter because of the waves. It's unpredictable there and the waves can get pretty high and it's scary when a big icy wave crashes over your head. So I'm out here in the Rocky Mountains in the west of Canada visiting my sister and today it's very foggy so you cannot see the beautiful mountains that are all around me but there are um, and I'm here for three weeks and she's a, a breeder a dog breeder of um, Nova Scotia duck tolling retrievers and so I work with her remotely and then the last couple weeks or the last few weeks of the puppy's life I help her with training before they get um, sent to their homes anyway so I'm out here for three weeks and I was just so inspired by the beauty of this place I've been out here before but I haven't been Wim Hofing while out here before so I was inspired to do this 30-day challenge for myself so I will be here for another another couple weeks I think and then uh, I'll go back home to Nova Scotia so you guys can also see where I dip um, locally at home. I hope one day we'll get a sunny day so you guys can see the beauty and the majesty of these mountains. They're really incredible. Um, I've been Wim Hofing for about a year more than a year and a half, maybe a year and eight months or something. I started when we went into the first lockdown in March, the end of March, uh, 2020. And I have been doing it ever since. Um, three, four times a week, I try to get out into nature and I also do cold showers, but I don't like them as much because it's much more exciting um, <clears throat> when you get out into nature. Um, it's much more exhilarating. It's kind of a torture to do cold showers for me, but in the summer I do it. I'm lucky because the Atlantic Ocean actually is really cold all year round. <laughs> so in the summers I get to go to the beach. Um, and that's about it. Those are the questions that I keep getting asked. Um, <clears throat> the Rocky Mountains. Yeah, that's where I am. <laughs> okay. Oh, and uh, for those of you wondering, uh, nobody's asked me this, but I'm wearing a different hat every day. This is a pretty fancy one. I'm lucky my sister has a lot of hats. I just brought one with me. <laughs> um, <clears throat> because I would like, when I'm done this 30-day challenge, to make a video of me spinning around with all kinds of different hats. Um, I don't know how to do video editing on the computer. I studied... Uh oh, the dogs are into something. Ah. I did study um, film at university. And so I know how to edit film, but like cutting and splicing with my own hands. So anyway, I'm going to challenge myself after I'm done this 30 day challenge to learn computer video editing. And if any of you have a good program that you like to use or any suggestions, let me know. Something that's user friendly because I'm not that tech savvy. Okay, Finley, what are you eating? She got something from my bag. I hope it's not dog poop. <laughs> so I'm gonna dunk today. Take off this pretty hat. Oh dear, hat head. Okay. 
Okay. Okay, you can see Theo. He doesn't like it when I dip. <laughs> okay, another dip. <sighs> the second time around, it's a lot colder. <sighs> but I would like to know if there are any benefits to doing this because if there are not, then I'd even not do it. <laughs>